Oh my god, I have like the entire fucking town after me now. Alright, come on. To the rooftops, Ezio! To the rooftops! Yeah, the guards can follow you on the rooftops, but they're good for breaking line of sight that way. Whee God, I had like eight of them after me. Go away, go away. No, ah, what are you doing? No! Shit. Whoops. And... Uh, come on, guys. Chill out. Yay. Okay, so, good. So we are now incognito. And the guards, you notice... Hi, guys! What up? Ow. Okay. Alright. It's cool. I'm gone. No, but you can see they're not getting all... They're, they're not getting that yellow air over their heads, and they don't really give a shit anymore. So, that's... That's a definite... Def, definite? Definite improvement. Uh, what am I doing next? Alright, so let's move on to the next data point. You can see we've also got... We've got a bunch of uh, activities down here. The completionist in me says we should go do those, so maybe we will, I don't know. Um, codex page, though, is definitely important, because we have to do this before the end of the game, or it won't let us finish. Um, but we've got time on that, so since we're right here, let's go do the next memory. Um, I don't even have to do that. I'm just gonna leave. Monsieur Giraldi can suck it. Gonna go over here. And back in the Rosa del whatever. Um. <sighs> One last time back to Paola. Bentornato, Ezio. Were you successful? I just like her name, Paola. Yes. Madre? Ezio! Where have you been? They wouldn't let us leave, and Mother... Oh. She hasn't spoken a single word since we left the house. Father will need to sort things out. Where is Father? And Federico? And Petruccio? Hmm? Something's happened. What do you mean? No, it's impossible. Claudia. No, 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 no. I did everything I could, Piccina. <laughs> Listen, right now what matters is getting us all someplace safe. But to do that, I need you to stay focused. Do you understand? Good. Will you watch over Mother for me? Then we are ready. Thank you again for everything. Stay safe, Ezio. Stay vigilant. I suspect the road ahead is yet long. Alright, so we need to escort Maria and Claudia out of the city. Follow my lead. And take them to. These guys start showing up for the first time. These, um, what are they called? Minstrels, I guess. My favorite way to make them go away is to just run into them, and then they'll get all upset. Alright, so. Yeah, and we learned about throwing money, which can be used to distract people, including, I think, guards. Yes, guards. I think the guards are being... Hello? Get out of it. Alright, fine, don't. Anyway, it calls lots of people over, distracts them. The guards don't seem all that inclined to get up in my face right now, so I don't know. 
Ooh, hurry. Whoa, so they won't notice anything else that's going on when you do that. We are almost to our little place here, yay. Alright, so we're going this way. Come on. I don't know exactly how this works, because the guards sometimes- I guess the guards sometimes get up in your face, but not always. I don't know, it's weird. So we're gonna go this way. over here that we need to get. We're going to use the courtesans to distract them. Alright, go. Like so. Grab onto them, instruct them. <laughs> One thing you want to be um, careful with... Go away. Is, yeah, this. Um, Hang on. These guys, if you're not careful, will stop it. Queen, let's do it. No, go away. <laughs> You'll basically end up having these courtesans following you out of the city, which is not what you want because um, you need them because they will. Telling them to stop will also tell Claudia and Maria to stop, which is a problem. So you basically end up leaving the city escorted by a bunch of whores. Um, but it's good, it, you know, keeps you out of sight. Anyway, so we're going over there, which is the road out of the city. Let's go. How could this have happened to us? I don't know. They're gonna know. come right along with us. Will we ever be back? I don't know. What will happen to our house? I don't know. Were they... Were they given a proper burial? Yes. They were. Alright, so that's that. And we have now left Firenze for the moment. And that's the end of Memory Sequence 2. And we are off to Monteregione, the Auditore Via in the country. Campagna. See, I told you, you learn a lot of Italian this way. Plus, I just like to sound erudite and sophisticated by calling it Firenze rather than Florence and such. So here we are. This is. Regione or Tus Tuscany, Toscana. Monte Regione being an area in Tuscany, I guess. This game really makes me want to go to Italy and like see all these things. Here we are. We should be close. Um, you gonna let me move? Okay. Escort Maria and Claudia to the Via de Torre in Monteregione. This way. Excellent. Run, 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 run. <gasps> oh no, people. Buongiorno, oh Ezio. no. How could you leave a Firenze without saying a proper goodbye? Ezio! What do you want, Vieri? So many things. A larger palazzo, two new steeds, a prettier bride. Oh, and yes, your life. 
My condolences for the loss of your father and brothers. <laughs> what will happen? Let's do this with this. Oh, I don't have my sword. Now, Never mind. No one left to help you. I have uh, such a wonderful JK. JK, we're gonna come over here. Cha. I grow tired of this game. Finish him! And do not it's spare the women! We're only in the third level. What sorcery is this? <laughs> not sorcery, boy. Skill. Show yourself! As you wish. Here, use this. Kill them! Kill them all! Like you! Okay. As I said, we are gonna meet the uh, mercenarios, and that's who these guys are. The Tuscany mercenaries, who will be a recurring feature of the game. Too many cooks, guys. Come on, there we go. You have my thanks. Keep the sword, Ezio. Do I know you from somewhere? Don't you recognize me? Wait for it. It's a me, Mario. Go, <laughs> Mario. It's been too long, you hotel. Far too long. I heard what happened in Firenze. Terrible. Come. Let's get you all away from here. Uncle Mario, who is, as it turns out, pretty damn awesome. 